Hey guys, it's Joanne here, and today I am bringing you a, well, I probably should take these off. <laughs> Hello. Uh, today I'm bringing you a, hopefully a quick video. Uh, I'm on the way in to actually go to the gym today. Yes, I do have my headphones ready for me so I can try to stay on the elliptical a little bit longer today. But today I wanted to bring you a quick video. I talked about it a little bit yesterday in my vlog that I had kind of organized everything for my car as far as like car stuff and emergency stuff or whatever. So I have this bag here that I got from Five Below and it's filled with a whole bunch of stuff, kind of like my own little emergency kit. I used to have a small little RX, tra a travel RX kit that I used to keep in my purse, but I found that it really just was, took up too much room. So what I've done was I've expanded it a little bit, put it in here so I could keep it in my car because I figured for the majority part of the time I'm always, in my car whenever I'm going someplace when Mike and I travel where we usually take my car so yeah so if you want to see what's in my emergency travel car bag then stay tuned So again, I got this bag at Five Below. I think it was like $3 and I loved it because of course the tie-dye theme. I love the front zip that actually you could like put something inside here that's clear if you want, if it needed to be see, if you needed to see something. I actually just threw on here a uh, Dollar Tree uh, antibacterial lotion or antibacterial you know gel stuff i'm probably going to replace this with the blue one that i just got the tootsie pop guy but uh for now i have this one on there which is just a it's the very it's weird all of these came with like very vanilla even though it has like a picture of a watermelon i don't know whatever and then also on the outside attached to the zipper i have a little flashlight which this flashlight actually um I'm just looking at it and it needs a new battery. So good thing I checked this out, huh? <laughs> it needs a, well, we're gonna have to replace this because this is the, these kind of batteries. So I do have another little bit bigger one than this, but I think you can pick these up at the Dollar Tree. So I guess, guess what I'm get, guess what I'm adding to my Dollar Tree list. Okay. So this is what the inside looks like. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna pull out is I'm just gonna pull out some basics. Uh, I, have a, I have a package of wipes and these wipes I got at Five Below and they are like cotton candy scented Hello Kitty wipes. They were $1.50 at Five Below. I just, they're like bubble gum cotton candy flavored scented wipes so I have those in case I need to wipe something I have a little mini spray uh, body spray the secrets fresh effects and this is the fresh water orchid scent and I've used probably about a quarter of it maybe a third of it I actually like the smell of this but this is just kind of like when you need like a little freshen up or whatever yeah so I have that in there. I also have in here a container of Utterly Smooth. I'm going to use this up. I usually, I've, I have since switched to where I'm using a lot of coconut oil for my lotions and my moisturizers, but I still had this. I'm still, I like to use up products that I've purchased. So I've used this. I'm going to keep it in here until it's gone. And then when it's gone, I'll probably replace it with either some of my own DIY lotion or my coconut oil that I use. So I have that in there. I am going to run out of room. Okay, next I just have is a package of tissues. I do have tissues in my car here in that Dollar Tree little hanging thingamabobber, but I always like to have an extra container of tissues just in case. I have an emergency brush, and this is a Dollar Tree brush. Again, it's just a little, you pull it up, it actually has a mirror. So this could potentially be good for rescuing, you know, 911 calls or whatever, like prepping or whatever. But you pop this out and this is like a little hairbrush. This actually works great in a pinch and doesn't take up a lot of room. I also have a container of, I love these plastic containers. I think I got this at Walmart because it originally is a container of Q-tips 
makeup removing wipes and I'll show you how they're really cool. So if you look very closely, these little wipes, they have like liquid inside of it. So you kind of like snap the end and then the liquid kind of comes to the end so you can use it for like a touch up or whatever. But what I've done is since I've used some of these, I've filled them with regular Q-tips. So I also have regular Q-tips and the Q-tips makeup wipes right inside of here. I just love this container. It just makes it so easy to be able to cart them around and not get them damaged or dirty or anything like that. So I got those. I also have a pen and paper because you never know when you need to leave a note or take notes or whatever. So I just, I got this from a, a colleague of mine that has an auto body shop here in Syracuse. And I've been using this for my little notebook inside my emergency kit and then i have in here two of these these are dollar tree these are dollar tree sunglass case or glasses cases so and i use these to kind of organize more a little bit more compartmentalize a little bit more things so inside here i have like i said here is an actual flashlight that works so i'm going to replace that purple one with this one for sure I'm just going to pull that right out. I also have a Swiss Army knife. So this is great for, you know, it has like a pair of scissors. It has a Phillips head, a regular screwdriver. It has, you know, scissors, a file. It's got, it's got, it's a whole bunch of things. So I really love these. Corkscrew. I like to have these. You know, this is good for an emergency. And then I have a little mini sewing kit in here. And this has like the cheap scissors that probably never work on anything. But it has some thread and it has a needle and it has like a little threader. I think I got this at the Dollar Tree as well. I'm going to put those back in. So that's all I have in here. And then in this pink one. I have some, uh, I have a little container and this was a, I think this was a Dollar Tree. This might not have been a Dollar Tree. I can't remember what this is. This has got a heavy duty magnet. I don't think this was Dollar Tree, but this, I have three kinds of headache medicine, which I really haven't used headache medicine in eons, to be honest with you guys. This is more for an emergency for people that I'm with, not necessarily for me, but I do have Aleve, Ibuprofen, and uh, what's the other one? Uh, the I can't remember. I'm sure you guys, the reddish orangish one, you guys know what that is. So I normally have these for people who are with me that might need them, but I hardly ever have any headaches anymore, so I don't need them. I also have, again, this is for other people now because I don't really use them that much, but this is just like a little container of um, antacids, like Tums that I like to carry with me just in case of an emergency. You never know when you might have like an upset stomach or something. I replace things usually like maybe once a year or a couple times a year just to make sure everything stays fresh. I also have two emergency little whisper things and these are kind of cool because they actually have a little bit of I guess like toothpaste kind of like built into the bristle and they're like little sample things. I can't remember where I got these. If I think I might have gotten these at the Dollar Tree and the little end actually has a little pick. So that's kind of cool too if you have something you know in your tooth that you need to pick on you need to pick it and then i just have two of these and these i got i know i got these at the dollar tree these are icy breeze cinnamon breath so whenever you just need to pick me up with the breath you can just pop a couple little drops on your tongue and you get some cinnamon breath so that is all i have in that container and so the last thing that i have and this is just the let yeah this is the last thing that i have inside there is an actual mini first aid kit. And I also had, as you see, three hair scrunchies on it in case I need them for whatever the case may be, but I do carry them with me and by keeping this closed. So I'm gonna open this up and inside of here, I have a nail file and this is a pretty heavy duty, thick, really good nail file. I also have a sample package of BioFreeze. This is great, this is like, pain relief it's like they call it cold therapy it's kind of like icy hot stuff but this is stuff that is given away by my uh, my chiropractor and it's very popular among you know like for muscle sores and stuff i also have in here antibiotic cream i have two things of monk fruit in the raw and this was before when i was actually eating when i was actually using sugar substitutes i don't necessarily 
use them anymore. It's very similar to stevia and the raw or monk fruit. Uh, it's not. It's not a. It's not an artificial sweetener. It actually comes from a monk fruit. It still actually spikes your blood sugar the same as regular sugar does. So this is literally just emergency for maybe somebody that I'm with that might need a sugar substitute. <laughs> hand cleansing wipes. I have two two little mini things of hand cleansing wipes. Johnson and Johnson. These are awesome. I love these, and I will leave a link in the description box below for where you guys can pick these up. These are Crystal Essence Towelettes. These are uh, mineral deodorants when you need to, like, <laughs> let's face it, let's say you have to run out, let's say you didn't get a chance to clean up like you should have, or maybe you came from the gym and you forgot to bring your stuff and you needed to go someplace else. This is a great, quick way to freshen yourself up. It's a mineral deodorant. You can kind of wipe yourself down. These are just here in emergency. There is, my favorite is pomegranate, and then I do have a lavender scent one. So go check these out. These are great to have on hand. I think they're, they're very reasonably priced. And then I have a nail clipper. And then I have an assortment of Band-Aids that are right here, just kind of mainly just like finger size Band-Aids. And then I have two gauzes. And that is really, that's it inside of this little, um, this little first aid kit portion of my emergency kit. So I'm gonna put this back in, see if I can get these all loaded up together. I'll get them all put away. So I'm gonna put this back in. We're gonna get our tissues back in. We're gonna get our, our Q-tips back in. I'm gonna get our wipes in, our lotion in. And we're gonna get our secret spray in and our notebook and our pen so that is that everything is everything is back in here except for the fact that I decided I wanted to keep this and I am going to replace my purple one with of course Hang on a second. Let me see if I can replace this. The purple one is on a carabinger, which I really like. <laughs> I'm going to keep the purple carabinger because I'm lazy like that. And I'm probably just going to toss this because it's probably, I can just get another one of these at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. So that is it for my video, guys. If you like these kind of organizational videos, please give me a big thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Joanne. Nice to meet you. If you're new, hit the, hit the subscribe button. You'll get notified as when I upload new videos. And if you hit the notification bell and click to receive notifications, you will make sure you will be in the know as to when I upload new videos, when I go live all those kind of fun things. You can also follow me on all of my other social media. I am at Joanne Plans on Snapchat, Instagram, Periscope, and Twitter. You guys be awesome. Enjoy the rest of your day, and I'm going to chat with you in my next video. Bye, guys.